Good afternoon, I'm Allie Hoxie with your headlines. The Detroit Red Wings now have a new head coach. GM Steve Eiserman just introduced Derek Lalonde at Little Caesars Arena. Arena. Lalonde spent the last four years as an assistant coach for the Tampa Bay Lightning. In those four years, the team took home two Stanley Cups. The coach says the first thing he wants to do is meet each player and discuss his vision for the future. Detroit police are planning a career fair tomorrow at police headquarters downtown. It's from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. and they're making it fun. It's going to be a family event with special activities for the kids. There are jobs for officers and opportunities for civilians as well. And 4th of July fireworks are back in Clawson. The pandemic derailed the celebration in 2020 and 2021. But this year, members of the planning committee say they felt safe enough to move forward. They say the money raised at this year's carnival will actually help pay for next year's fireworks. And if it's anything like pre pandemic levels, that turnout could be somewhere near 40,000 people. Admission will be $2 at the gate on Sunday and Monday. And there are several other fireworks shows taking place throughout the Detroit area this weekend. Brighton will be putting on a fireworks show tonight at 10 at Willow Metro Park. And tomorrow, Milford will be lighting up the sky at Kensington Metro Park. That starts around 10 p.m. Also happening tomorrow, the Clarkston Independence Fest Fireworks. That's taking place 10 p.m. at Clintwood Park. And fortunately, it looks like our weather will cooperate for the weekend, too. So good news there. We just have a few hours this afternoon and evening that scattered showers and storms will likely pop up across Metro Detroit. A few could be on the stronger side. We'll stay in the mid 80s through Sunday. It is going to be hotter on the 4th of July, Monday, and a little more humid with just a chance for a passing shower or storm.